favorite depiction of how I look when I wake up. Except for sometimes, like, instead of the bun still being there, it'd be like half of my hair just out looking rough. But uh, this is life. <laughs> I don't have any shoots. Um, I have a trip planned for next week, so I think I want to get stuff prepared for that. Also, I'm going to be doing some hair today, braiding it, but that's not until later in the day. And normally I have plans on Saturday in the morning and then the second half of my day is normally like for me. But today it's flipped around a little bit, which I'm kind of used to because I'm used to having like the mornings for myself throughout the weekdays or later in the evening. I'm going to be... What's up? <laughs> Oh, you thought I was putting yeah. it at you? I'm gonna be doing that. Okay, so. Made it on the walk finally, and it is already super hot. Um, I've only been walking for about like 10 minutes, and the sweat is dripping. Yeah, I'm glad I got my walk in now because I feel like within the next hour it's gonna be blazing hot. I ended up pouring my coffee in here and taking it with me to go because I didn't want it to like the ice to get all melted and stuff. I'm actually like really thirsty. I don't even want it. I just want some water. Think about me. Think about me and it's so good. What's the difference? It was just like one of those rest day, get stuff done type of days. I've been pretty much on my computer all day. It's just been flying by this whole month. I think it's because all the every weekend I had something to do and like all the birthdays and stuff like that. So I feel like that obviously contributed to that. I got a burp. <coughs> Some light. I feel like that contributed to it. So it just felt like August came and went. Summer is almost over already, but I'm excited because I have a trip planned. This is like the last trip of summer. It was like one of those like wrapping up type of trips and a nice little small group of us. Uh, we're, we're not gonna be around a lot of people at all. A nice, another girls trip and a nice way to wrap up the summer like I was saying before it's like back to school for everybody. And I mean, technically everybody started like this week. It's like our last hurrah <laughs> of the summer. Of course for me, I'm just doing the same thing, working and yada yada, but uh, it's gonna be a nice little Little trip. But yeah, thanks for continuing to support and tuning in these videos. I've been enjoying it. I feel like I've been doing a good job of staying consistent at a pace or like in a way that doesn't feel overwhelming for me. It's just something that I could just do and not get in the way of my other things, but also give me like something to look forward to, especially during these times where it's everything is so weird. I'm trying to come up with like new <laughs> video ideas and things that are more exciting than just watching me in a hoodie all day. This is just like the realistic part of my life. And I'm also still glad that although we're moving into fall because I live in the Bay Area, we don't really get like seasons per se. Like it's more just like generally doesn't get too hot or too cold except for like Sometimes if there's heat waves, it'll get really, really hot. It's like in the summer, it just is consistently a nice high hottish temperature and then during the like winter more consistently like a 50s to 60s degrees like during fall you'll get like a lot of still hot days until probably about like i don't know january january february march is like the coldest and like most like i don't know because around march it starts to become spring a little bit but i feel like in spring it's like just a real wild card like you never really know what you're gonna get in spring 80 degrees one day and then thunderstorming and be like 46 degrees the next day or it could be all of that in one day you really just don't know what you're gonna get i guess just something about living in the bay area so what i was gonna say was that like one good thing about moving into the fall although it's like moving into the fall it is still pretty warm outside although you probably can't tell by what i'm wearing at least i still have a little bit of a cushion before we go into like daylight saving and then you know everything just goes downhill from there <laughs> no i'm just kidding but i just I am not um, very fond of it being dark at 4 p.m. It's not, it's not my jam, it's not my vibe. Yeah. Okay, so I was randomly just thinking about something 
as I was walking. Basically, I was thinking about how I hate <laughs> what a one pet peeve of mine when people like text you first and like hit you. They're the ones that hit you up first, but it's very vague. And I'm doing a horrible job of explaining this. I basically hate when people don't get straight to the point when they reach out to you, basically. Why didn't I just say that the first time? <laughs> As I'm speaking about getting to the point. Like, okay, for instance, when somebody texts you and they're like, hey, or what's up? It's like, okay, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not saying that I don't want nobody to text me and check up on me. Not what I'm saying. I'm just saying I hate when they just text me that one word and like don't give me nothing to work with of just like okay what do you want me to say i'm gonna say the same thing back hi what's up just <laughs> what i'm saying is instead of just being like hey like just say hey and then get to the reason why you're reaching out so basically if it's like a dm or something on instagram you could be like instead of being like hey you could be like hey just came across your your page um i like your photos What's another one? Or if you're like trying to get at somebody and you're just like, hey, like, <laughs> what are we supposed to do with that? <laughs> just be like, hey, just uh, came across you. Um, hope you're having a nice day. Or like have a follow up for that. Like get to the point. Hey, I think you look really cute. Just uh, wanted to let you know. Um, all right, have a good day. Go about your day. Something like that. Or like if you need some, if you're reaching out for like a favor or to see if I'm free or something and you're just like, hey, are you busy right now? Or hey, are you free this da -da -da -da, this day? Please give me a follow up, <laughs> Please give me a why because depending on what the thing is that you want me to attend or the reason why you're reaching out, I may be free, I may not be free. If it's something like you just need, you're seeing if I'm free to chat on the phone, that's something I could be like, yeah, I got five minutes, like call me right now. But if it's something like, hey, I need to go shopping, I want you to come with me, da da da, it depends on if I want to. So if I tell you, <laughs> if I'm gonna say, yeah, I'm free, I'm not doing that thing, but then you say, oh yeah, okay, because I wanted to do X, Y, Z, da da da, I need to go here, there, there, I need you to do this, then I'm gonna be like, well, I'm free, but not to do that. Basically, I just don't like when people don't get straight to the point with what they're reaching out for. I'm not talking about just like checking in with people and being like, hey, just uh just was thinking about you want to check in see how you was doing or hey i haven't talked to you in a minute uh just wanted to say hi that's completely fine that's completely different because you're still getting to the point of why you reached out you're like i just wanted to say hi or i just wanted to see how you're doing or hey i just haven't talked to you in a while what's up i don't mind that at all i actually really i really like that but if you're just like hey like <laughs> get to it or if you need a favor and you're just like hey can i ask a favor like just just ask it <laughs> is what i'm saying like just be like hey are you free on friday um because i was planning on doing this i wanted to see if you're doing this like get to it you don't have to wait for me to respond and say hi back for you to then go into a thing and i know there's like you don't want to be rude and you want to like have a greeting and not just be like can you do this for me like i understand that but you could start with the greeting say hey da 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 how's it going makai i haven't talked to you in a minute i was wondering and then like get to the point <laughs> I feel like I sound rude and I'm or I'm just not making sense but I just wish I just don't like fluff like that, that doesn't mean you have to be so direct and rude is what I'm saying but just follow up and get to the meat and potatoes of it like uh, now that I'm like saying it and trying to explain it I feel like I just sound kind of rude but like I don't even mean it in a rude way I just want people to get to the purpose get to the point I don't know I just don't like <laughs> I just it just kind of irritates me when people just hi what's up hey like you could say that say hey and then get to the purpose I don't know how to explain it it just it kind of annoys me and I always get on Dee Dee for that my little sister because she's one of those people that will text me a hey. and then like literally I will just she knows that I don't like that <laughs> so I will just um be like sarcastic with her and text her back like b or I just will wait for a long time to respond and see like maybe she'll follow up and say something of what she reached out for and if she don't then she'll just if, if I don't text her back and she don't follow up and be like what she was gonna say, like why she was saying A, hey, then she'll just call me and then, I'll, and then we can get to the point. So I'm like, I just don't like that. <sighs> now that I've spent a good 10 minutes 
talking about that. Um, I'm gonna get back to some editing, but I just thought about that and I was like, it's just, I don't know why it bothers me, but it just kind of, and it's not like it's one of those things that like really bother me, like I'm really upset or feeling some type of way about it. It's not that deep, but it just is something that I'm like, why do people do that? But yeah. It's all dusty. <sighs> I'm attempting to giving myself a leave. Bundles down here. And we'll see how this turns out. Okay, so I'm actually kind of impressed. I wish the length was longer. Um, the longest that they had was 20. So, I mean, it still is pretty decently long but I wanted it to be a little bit like right here like 22 24 but this will work so I have the leave out I need to do any more because I like it full but honestly when I brush it out it's a little more full so Coop in the whip, Betty Boop was my bitch in the